Bonjour à toutes et à toutes et bienvenue sur le live. Aujourd'hui, euh, je vais vous montrer euh, l'X3 de la de Microsoft. Ce que j'ai fait, c'est que tout ce que vous allez voir là, euh, après, je mettrai une petite pause euh, sur euh, le dernier, euh, la, le truc qu'on a vu, et on en parlera ensemble parce que je voudrais vos réactions euh, de ce que vous allez voir. Allez, je lance. Euh C'est parti. Et là, j'ai pas parlé pendant que. This is the Xbox E3 2019 briefing. most efficient structure history has ever shown us. Scheduled scarcity is a premium feature of colonial life. The colony must never lose faith. That is what the board provides. Security in a senseless and chaotic world. This is Halcyon, the furthest colony in the galaxy. Proudly owned and operated by corporations. Everything we have, everything we are, We owe to them. They are always with us. No one has ever gone against them. But a stranger has just arrived. Someone who's challenging the corporate board. Someone who's digging up their secrets. Someone who could be a villain or a hero. Looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Here, hope this gun serves you better than it did me. Or a psychopath. Oh. Did you ever think you'd end up like this? My time to shine. I suppose time will tell, but no matter who this stranger chooses to be, the Halcyon Colony will never be the same.
baisser mon micro. Je voudrais vos réactions sur le premier jeu que vous voyez. Le cut YouTube ou tout ça, euh, ce que vous avez vu. Si vous voulez en parler, vous pouvez. pas mal ce jeu mais pas il euh, n'y a pas la date de sortie mais euh, il a l'air pas mal ce jeu euh, si quelqu'un sur le chat pouvait parler ce serait bien parce que moi là je sais pas si euh, je suis tout seul ou pas live s'il vous plaît à part Nitori ah non parce que là euh, moi j'aimerais bien avoir vos réactions sur ce que vous avez vu là en premier jeu bon bah je crois que je les avoir toutes sur le sur Youtube hein. bon euh... passons au deuxième jeu et je reviens euh, après euh, le deuxième jeu Please welcome from Ninja Theory, Ronnie Tucker and Dom At E3 2018, we announced that Ninja Theory had joined Xbox Game Studios, a move that has given us an incredible boost in achieving the creative ambition of our teams. We've started work on a number of new games at the studio, and in the near future, we'll be sharing details on all of these projects. When we joined Xbox Game Studios, we already had a very exciting game several years in the making, and we're happy to return to E3 to share this with you. As creative director, I'm stoked to be here to share our new game with you guys. It combines two of my gaming passions, third-person action combat, and competitive team multiplayer. Our technical alpha is kicking off in just a couple of weeks, and we'd love for you to sign up, get involved, and tell us what you think. Or if you're here at E3, come and join us for a game. I really, <laughs> I really hope you guys like it. Check it out. This is Bleeding Edge. Yeah. de ce jeu c'est que ça va être une bataille royale euh, comme euh, Overwatch et tout ça ben euh, moi je suis pas trop euh, pour ce jeu comme ça même si j'ai pas encore euh, d'Xbox euh, ça me dit rien euh, Bleeding euh, Edge euh, je suis pas un joueur euh, de 7 30 
trucs euh, sur ce jeu, vous pouvez, hein, euh, et c'est pour ça que je fais ça. Autre, euh, parce que là, moi, je vous le dis directement, je, si j'avais une Xbox, euh, je prendrais pas. Et plus tard, je vous ferai, euh, et peut-être que demain, je vous ferai la, le truc de Nintendo. Parce que Nintendo, là, euh, ils, sont, ils, sont, ils vont sortir de bons jeux. Allez, on continue. Mais au, le premier, dès que je peux, je, je me le prends. Mathieu Horry, c'est un énorme jeu. Parce que vous avez vu déjà le, mon, le monstre qui est bien fait. Euh, le, petit, euh, le, le petit dragon pour moi. Le petit, le, le petit, le petit euh, monstre blanc là, qu'on incarne. Il est vachement beau. Et il est magnifique. Si vous voulez dire des trucs sur le jeu, vous pouvez. Parce que là, j'ai mis en pause exprès. Parce que là, ce live, il est là pour ça. Pour dire ce qu'on pense du jeu. Et euh, de Microsoft euh, aussi. Allez, on repart sur euh, le troisième jeu. Minecraft. Euh, je n'y ai jamais joué euh, sur le PC. 
difficulté parce que déjà moi je suis sous curatel euh, je vais pas payer les, le jeu mais euh, je trouve euh, pas mal celui-là de minecraft il a l'air pas mal mais avoir le prix parce que si c'est un euh, minecraft comme euh, ils l'ont fait euh, sur euh, là euh, anciennement Pas mal, mais euh, je préférais l'ancien. Hein, vu que moi j'ai regardé des lives euh, de Minecraft. Parce que là, euh, c'est en, en donjon, euh, ligne droite, gauche et droite. Avec des dragons, tout ça. Euh, non. Non. Là, euh, Microsoft euh, vont trop loin. Pour moi. Allez, on passe au jeu suivant s'il y en a un. Please welcome the head of Xbox, Phil Spencer. Thank you. Thank you. We on Team Xbox live for this exact moment. The moment we get to share the best of our art form here with you in LA. And the moment you get to experience breathtaking new stories, new worlds, and new heroes for the very first time. This moment isn't just about finding some new games, it's about discovering your new games. This decisive moment of discovery is etched in your gaming history. Alongside your every achievement, your every moment, your every new friend. This is why we on Team Xbox are always and will be dedicated to unleashing the next new games for you to discover and love. So whether you're one of the thousands with us here in Microsoft Theater, <laughs> or one of the billions around the world who play games, welcome to E3 2019. <laughs> This right now, is the single most creative and energizing time in gaming history. Games and gamers together now have the sheer magnitude to be a significant unifying force for the world. The expanding universe of gaming has opened a new era of creative possibility. With more games, more creators, and more industry players than ever before. And gamers, were everywhere. In under two decades, the number of players in the world has more than tripled. Over two billion of us now play games in every region and on every continent. And with new technological leaps, we get to play whatever we want, with whomever we want, and wherever we want. On Team Xbox, every decision is guided by our belief that gaming is for everyone. My team and I are single-minded in our resolve to bring everyone the games they want, to connect everyone to play with the friends they want, and to empower everyone to play wherever they want. This is why we keep innovating hardware and services. It's why we're uniting communities through crossplay, and why it's why we're investing with new distinctive creators. Above all, gaming is for you. This is why we scour the world for your next new games. This today is the largest showcase of games on any stage, anywhere this year. Today, 
from the thousands of games in development across Xbox One and Windows PC, we're highlighting 60 games for you. <laughs> including 14 games from Xbox Game Studios and over 30 games premiering in Xbox Game Pass. In addition to showcasing all of these games over the show, we'll also announce what's next at Xbox Game Studios. Sharing our expansive plans for streaming, and of course, revealing more about our next new console. So thank you for joining us today. Let's jump in. Calcastus. Sogorero. I'm here on Jedi business. Jedi are dead. Not all of them. A Jedi. Yeah, I'm okay. You all right? No, we are not doing that again. Alors moi là, pour moi, euh, ce jeu Fallen euh, Order, euh... c'est pas trop mon truc. Moi, j'aime bien euh, les Star Wars. Ils auraient dû t'arrêter, ils, ils auraient dû t'arrêter à ce qu'ils ont fait euh, où il y a beaucoup de joueurs, tout ça. Parce que là, euh, je trouve qu'ils se perdent un peu. Si vous voulez dire des trucs sur ce jeu, vous pouvez. Allez, c'est reparti. World Premiere. <rire> What the? Okay, Bullet. Let's find this kid. Wait up, Bullet! Bullet!
my man. You made it. You blowing up all over the news. Are you alone? I just want the money. You got the chip? All right. Start her up, bug. Why don't you go to the bathroom? Wash up. We gonna be with you in a minute. Wow. Oh, come on, man. Your neck. It's a mess. While hotel security has yet to comment, we do know the suspect seems to have fled the scene. Initiating combat mode. Go! Destination confirmed. Woo That's what I'm talking about! All right! In and out! We're rich! Oh, we are going to the major leagues, Jack! Right. <laughs> Jack? Oh, oh s***! No. no, 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 no. Okay, oh. get to a clinic, now. Mr. Wells' condition is critical. Go! Immediate medical help okay. is required. Just, just hold on. Just... Oh. Hey, hey, just think about all the good s*** that we're gonna have, huh? I'm oh, sorry. Decks. Every corporal cop in this city is gonna be blasting down these doors after what you and your psycho friend did. We didn't need all this tension, damn it. Wake the f up, samurai. We have a city to burn. Good to see you. Thank you. All right. All right. I got to talk to you about something. <laughs> I mean, we got to talk to you about something. CD Project Red. Cyberpunk 2077. All right. A while back. The guys from CD Projekt Red approached me and asked me to be a part of their new project, Cyberpunk 2077. They were going on and on about how they'd create this vast open world with a branching storyline, how you'd be able to customize your character through in-game choices. And it's not something I knew before, but I was excited by it. And I'm always drawn to fascinating stories. Yeah. Cyberpunk <laughs> is set in a metropolis of the future where body modification has become an obsession, 
You play as an outlaw, an enhanced mercenary working in the sleazy underbelly of the city. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but let me tell you, the feeling of, of being there, of walking the streets of the future, is really going to be breathtaking. You're breathtaking. <laughs> You're breathtaking. You're all breathtaking. All right, all right, all right. So I guess I got to finish this. So tell me. Do you guys want to know um, when there's uh, when it, the release date? Yeah. All right. Then check this out. Mr. Hansen, am I right for the job? Okay, I'm in. You have gone through to the other side. Let's do this. World Premiere. Ha, ha, ha. 
Please welcome Head of Xbox Partnerships, Sarah Bond. All the ID at Xbox games you just saw will premiere on Xbox Game Pass day one. At Xbox, our passion is to help you find and play the games that you love through creation, curation, and discovery. The ultimate expression of that passion is Xbox Game Pass. My team travels the globe, seeking out fan favorites and hidden gems and crafts partnerships with their creators so that you can discover your next favorite game. Mind-blowing experiences epic adventures, and iconic characters, all for you to explore. It has been awesome to see the record-breaking success developers have had in Xbox Game Pass, introducing their games to new players and creating lifelong fans. Since launch, we have tripled the number of partners in Game Pass, adding more games from more genres, platformers, RPG, adventure, sports, puzzles, and more every single month. And of course, every Xbox Game Studios title you see today will premiere in Game Pass day one. We are thrilled to announce new titles coming to Xbox Game Pass on console today, including Batman Arkham Knight, Metro Exodus, <laughs> Hollow Knight, and Borderlands The Handsome Collection. Amazing games that you can start playing today. Our mission at Xbox is for you to be able to play any game with anyone, anywhere. And we know for many of you, that means PC. That is why <laughs> last month we announced Xbox Game Pass for PC. <laughs> Today, the Game Pass journey on PC begins. Now, PC players can discover their next favorite game with Xbox Game Pass. We have curated over 100 games just for PC, including favorites like Emperor Rome and Football Manager 2019. And for the first time on PC, starting with Halo Reach, the entire Master Chief Collection. We are thrilled to share that Xbox Game Pass for PC launches in open beta today. Whenever you're ready. Xbox Game Pass for PC is here now. Try it out by downloading the all-new Xbox app on Windows. And if you want it all, we have created a membership just for you. Xbox Game Pass Ultimate.
You get everything. Xbox Game Pass for console with over 100 great games. Xbox Live Gold, an unrivaled gaming community. And now, Xbox Game Pass for PC at no additional charge. And because it's E3, everyone can jump in and play today for one dollar. Now go discover your next favorite game. World premiere. Do you remember a time when armies were built and powerful cities collapsed? When the smallest of choices echoed through the pages of history? It was an age of empires. Razors? I said you were a donkey's age. Welcome to beautiful Colorado. Home to the Purple Mountains Mastigy of the Rockies. Hike through colorful canyons. Get up close and personal with a wild and woolly wild duck. Sample home-cooked delicacies. Eat where the locals eat. Visit Colorado Springs. There's so much to see and do in this post-apocalyptic winter wonderland. Meet new people. Make new friends. Colorado has colorful characters and friendly faces everywhere you look. See our beautiful airport. And don't forget to pick yourself up a nifty souvenir. So don't be shy, Colorado's waiting for you. <laughs> first round's on me, uh, first round's on, on you. Please welcome head of Xbox Game Studios, Matt Booty. are 
at the heart of our mission. Over the last year, we added seven new game development studios to Xbox. It's fantastic to see some of these studios already sharing new games on our E3 stage, and there's more to come. I have the privilege of working with some of the best studios around the globe. And for me, great studios are about people, teams, and ideas. Our success comes down to one thing, creating great games that players love. And great games come from great developers. That's why I'm honored today to announce that joining Xbox Studios is Double Fine Productions. <laughs> Double Fine has been a beacon of creativity and spirit in game development for almost 20 years with classic games like Psychonauts, Brutal Legend, and Broken Age. I'm looking forward to Double Fine joining Xbox and seeing what we create together. Please join me in welcoming the founder and president of Double Fine Productions, Tim Schaefer. Thank you so much, and thank you, Matt. We are so excited to be joining Xbox Game Studios, and I'm here to personally reassure you, Matt, I don't know what you've heard, but I'm a team player. Whatever you need from Double Fine, we'll make for you. Uh, Halo stuff, uh, Forza stuff, Excel stuff, whatever you want, we are there. Yeah. Tim, we just want you to make great games. Oh, that's such a relief, because I was totally lying. <laughs> In that case, we brought a brand new trailer for Psychonauts 2. Take a look if you dare. My name is Raz, and today is my first official day on the job. We're on a mission. Rasputin? I'm on him. Looking for me? <laughs> oh, no. No. <laughs> Mia, the mission is falling apart. We've lost control of Roboto. I put the old egg in the box in the basket. <laughs> I won't tell anyone! I promise! No, please! World Premiere
world premiere. I have a surprise for you. Okay. <laughs> You want to guess what it is? Hmm. This is an outfit for a newborn. You bought it this morning. You wanted to surprise me. I'm sorry. You're pregnant. You know? I know because you already gave it to me. This has happened before. What are you talking about? What's going on? Someone is coming. He's going to hurt us. He says you killed your father. I need to know what happened. <laughs> Why are you doing this? My father died. Died of a heart attack? No, I, 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 I didn't have anything to do with... Any second now, he's gonna knock on that door. Help me. This isn't happening. This can't be happening. Police, open up. That's him. Did you call the police? We have a warrant. Please open the door. I didn't do anything. We're here to help. Don't listen to him. I'm your only chance. Open the door, right now! You know me. I love you. You have to believe me. Stop! No. You're under arrest. No. Hey! You're home. What are you doing? Are you okay? scared of me why do you care for me when we all fall asleep where do we go
From the Coalition, please welcome Studio Head Rod Ferguson. Thanks, everyone. We're excited to announce that Gears 5 is releasing on September 10th. And if you want to play four days early, you can with our Ultimate Edition or membership in the newly announced Xbox Game Pass Ultimate. With Gears of War 4, we wanted to earn your trust. But with Gears 5, we want to push the envelope by doing new things never seen in a Gears game before. And we'll tell you all about it this summer. In July, join us for our Versus Multiplayer Tech Test, where you'll be one of the first to play our all-new competitive game type, Arcade. In August, at Gamescom, go hands-on with the all-new Horde mode and see how character abilities can turn the tide on the battlefield. In September, we return to the biggest Gears campaign ever, where we'll explore more of Kate's harrowing journey and celebrate our launch on September 10th. But what are we talking about today? Today, it's a brand new way to fight the swarm. In Escape, you play as one of three hive busters. You and your squad infiltrate the hive, plant the bomb, and escape with your life. Because we all know the best defense is a good offense. It's everything you love about Gears turned up to 11. Attacked, and we lost everything. Everything except the need for revenge. This might look like a surrender, but it's not. It's an invasion. <laughs>
I hope you enjoyed your taste of escape, an aggressive three-player co-op experience, perfect for your living room couch. But it's not just about busting hives. You can build them, too, and challenge your friends with the experiences you create. And tonight, join me on Mixer as we challenge these three WWE superstars, Xavier Woods, AJ Styles, and Tyler Breeze, to survive a gameplay deep dive from right here in the hive. For these at home, for the next two days, you and your friends can play in select Microsoft stores. So good luck out running the swarm, and we'll see you on the leaderboard. Oh, and for anyone who pre-orders or plays within the first week, we've got something special just for you. My father saved my life. He told me never to forget who I am, where I come from. But in this place, nobody even wants to know my name. Getting attached is deadly. Because when darkness comes, I might be gone. This tore society apart, but I won't let it turn me into an animal. Staying alive became the essence of our existence, yet life must be more than just survival. Every day, the disease tries to crush us and make us forget who we are, but I keep fighting. My name is Aiden, and I am infected. World Premiere.
please welcome Ralph Fulton. Combine McLaren's passion for design with about half a million of LEGO's legendary bricks. You get this incredible life-size LEGO Speed Champions McLaren Senna. Combine the beauty and freedom of Horizon with the playful fun of LEGO, you get the Forza Horizon 4 LEGO Speed Champions expansion. You will drive this Senna and more LEGO Speed Champions cars in an entirely new world, packed with inventive new challenges, new areas to explore, and loads of bricks to smash. The Forza Horizon 4 LEGO Speed Champions expansion launches this week. I'll see you there. My mission, find the father I never knew. My mission, find a hero I've never met. He hasn't radioed in days. He hasn't been seen since the outbreak. The last time I heard his voice. The last place he was seen was in Trumbull Valley. Valley. I've only heard whispers. I've only heard legend of unseen horrors. Here, we are the many. Here, we can become stronger. For so long, I was just surviving. Now people are counting on me. This is where my story could end. This is where my story could begin. I thought we had seen everything. We ain't seen nothing yet. World Premiere.
Those of you who have played Fantasy Star know that this game had influenced many of the most popular games today. So with great delight, we welcome Sega back to our stage and Fantasy Star back on Xbox. As we said, our goal on Team Xbox is to bring you the world's best games. Meeting with developers, playing their games, and introducing you to their games, these are the best parts of my job. Back at E3 2017, when I first met with the creators of this next game, they shared their ambition to bring their massively popular game with its passionate community of 650 million PC players to the entire world. I'm happy to announce our partnership with the legendary team at Smilegate. Their approach to game design demonstrates sheer creative boldness. Next year, you'll discover the newest entry in this landmark franchise. On console, for the very first time, only on Xbox. This is Crossfire X. World premiere. World Premiere.
are six sirens in the universe. I used to be one of them. My name is Lilith, and I need you. Followers demand we join or die. We've got another proposal for them. World Premiere. Please welcome back, Phil Spencer. From multinational studios to one-person passion projects, thousands of Xbox games are in development for you right now. 
Just today, we showed you 60 games. We are now experiencing an unmatched expansion of creativity on Xbox. Gaming for you means connecting all of these creators to all of you. Last fall, we announced our ambition to empower everyone everywhere to play by bringing Xbox to the cloud. We will do this in two ways, through Project X Cloud and through console streaming. Two months ago, we connected all Xbox developers to Project X Cloud. Today, we invite those of you here at E3 for our first public hands-on of Project X Cloud. <laughs> to experience the freedom to play right here at the show. And you'll have two ways to stream. There's a new platform feature, console streaming. It turns your Xbox One into your own personal and free xCloud server. Whether you're using a console in our data center or your console at home, this October, you'll be able to use our hybrid gaming cloud to play your games wherever you go. Where you play is now entirely your choice. You decide. So let's talk about our next console. For us, the console is vital and central to our experience. We heard you. A console should be designed and built and optimized for one thing and one thing only, gaming. So the same team that created the world's most powerful console, Xbox One X, and innovated its groundbreaking processor and the Elite Controller, the same team that engineered the world-class compatibility of today's Xbox One consoles, the same team that set the bar for live gaming services with Xbox Live, this same team set out on a new mission to create the future of gaming for you. When we think about the future of gaming, it's not just PC, it's not just console, it's not just mobile, it's really all of the above. Xbox is all about choice. We're investing in technology all throughout the game stack. The games you want with the people you want on the devices that you want. And for us, that starts with our next generation console. We don't want to build just another console. We truly want it to be transformative. More immersion, more exploration, more detail. How do we make it easier for people to get into the game, to stay in the game? One of the things that gamers and developers are incredibly excited about is reducing load times. I'm an RPG gamer, and so, like, loading screens are a thing. You're sitting there in the fake elevator because you know that the game's loading in the background. It's just an elevator ride forever. That's our goal with gaming, is that you don't have those pauses. This generation is going to be a bigger leap than any generation we've done before. At the heart of our next generation console is our custom design processor, leveraging the latest Zen 2 and Navi technology from our partners at AMD. From a pure processing perspective, this is four times more powerful than the Xbox One X. We're leveraging high bandwidth GDDR6 to ensure that we're getting the best performance possible. It's going to usher in resolution and frame rates that we've never seen before. Like, never seen before. We're looking at frame rates up to 120 frames per second. 8K capability, variable refresh rate. Next gen ray tracing. It's real time because it's hardware accelerated for the first time ever. What I'm personally most excited about is the SSD. We've created a new generation of SSDs. We're actually using the SSD as virtual RAM. We're seeing more than 40 times performance increases over the current generation. The combination of the SOC and the solid state drive are really what gives you a totally new experience. Now we can take all of that power and apply it back into the scene. So we can actually generate more life in that world and bring it to the gamer in a seamless way. So that then you're fully experiencing what the game developer wants you to experience. When you can move through worlds without waiting for screens to low, that speed, that performance is what the next generation is about. This is the most immersive console experience ever. 
What we really want to do is give developers the power to build the game they've always envisioned. We have hundreds of people across both our first party studios as well as our third party studios working on those next generation experiences today. It's an amazing commitment to content at Xbox Game Studios. 13 studios, seven in the last year. That's a big family. At 343, for us it's always about more seamless worlds with the next generation. We can bring the world to life in a way we've never experienced Halo before. We're delivering four generations of content better than you've ever seen them before. This console is especially awesome for Game Pass members. With the faster load times, you're going to be able to experience all the games within just a snap of your fingers. We're giving gamers the option to connect across devices and across platforms in a way that we never were able to before. This isn't just a console launch. This is about the future of gaming. Your games, your achievements, your progression, your accessories, your console gaming experience with Xbox, it all comes forward with Scarlet. It eats monsters for breakfast. This is Project Scarlet, the most powerful and highest performing console oh, we've ever designed. Built for creators to unleash their boldest creative visions and optimize for players to enjoy the ultimate gaming experience on a console anywhere. Immersive experiences begin at the very heart of the console, at the silicon level itself. Together with our partners at AMD, we have co-engineered and custom designed a state-of-the-art processor for Project Scarlet. Power you could see defined previous generations. Power and performance you can see and feel defines Project Scarlet. When we talk about freedom to play, when we talk about Xbox in the cloud, when we talk about streaming your games, Project Scarlet and all of its power and all of its performance is the foundation of our future in console and the formation of our future in cloud. We launched Xbox 18 years ago with a game reviewers called the definitive reason to own an Xbox. Well, because humanity was and is worth saving, next holiday, we will launch Project Scarlet with Halo. Daddy, how big you are? Are you so big? <laughs> and can you sing? Good singing. How about I miss you? Miss you. And I love you. I love you. I love you, Daddy. I love you, Daddy. And I can't wait to see you. Can you say see you? See you. Okay, and bye bye. Bye bye.
Pelican Echo 216. Can you hear me? This is UNS. Looks like the main power cells are fried. Attends, non, c'est shut down. Triggering survival mode. C'est à l'eau ce, ce jeu là qu'on voit. I'm going to try to override. C'est à l'eau. Okay. If you can hear me in there. I hope you're ready. Please don't die. Please. Don't. Chief, I rerouted what little power I had into your suit. Hmm. Looks like there's a problem with the servos in your hands. Stay calm. You've been out there a while. I know I saw something in here to check your armor's diagnostics. Status report. Status report. There's something new to see. This is UNSC Pelican Echo 216. Can you hear me? This is UNSC. <laughs> Looks like the main power cells are fried. Armor shut down. Triggering survival mode. I'm going to try to override. Okay. Uh, no. You can hear me in there. I hope you're ready. Please don't die. Please. Don't die. I rerouted what little power I had into your suit. Hmm. Looks like there's a problem with the servos in your hands. Stay calm. You've been out there a while. I know I saw something in here to check your armor's diagnostics. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy there, big guy. You're not. Status report. 
Status report. What? There's something you need to see, Chief. We lost. Lost everything. There's nothing left for us here. I don't even know where here is. No, 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 Not then. Not again. We need to run. No. We need a fight. qui termine euh, le truc de l'E3 Pendant quelques minutes, on peut parler euh, tranquille là, vu que c'est fini. Et là, comme tu as vu en haut, euh, pour ma chaîne YouTube, tu pourras aller dessus pour voir euh, la rediffusion. Moi, j'ai vu que le premier euh, des Harry Potter. Je peux te repasser euh Euh non, pas encore. Il n'est pas 
encore regarder celui-là. Il a l'air pas mal. Là, t'as juste à faire un copier-coller et tu pourras y aller de suite sur ma chaîne. Ouais, et là, il y en a un que j'attends d'aller voir euh, aussi, comme film, mais que tout le monde pourri, que ce soit sur Twitter ou autre chose, parce qu'il euh, a été mal fait, c'est Sonic. Parce que là, ils vont le refaire, mais euh, pour... Euh... Non, pas encore. Parce que là, ils sont encore en train de le peaufiner, tout ça. Parce que là, vu que euh, tout le monde sur, sur Twitter euh, se sont plein de ce Sonic, qu a, qui a été mis euh, pour, pour, pour la bande-annonce, tout ça qu'on a vu, vu. Ben, euh, là, ils sont en train de tout le refaire. Ce qui veut dire que pas avant euh, novembre, décembre, il va sortir. Ah, il est sorti, euh, détective euh, Pikachu. Celui-là, je ne euh, suis pas encore allé le voir, mais on m'a dit qu'il était super bien. Ouais, je sais. À moins que tu aies des gens euh, que tu connais bien, qui peuvent t'avoir des places gratuites. Comme moi, j'ai ma mère qui peut m'avoir des places gratuites. Oui, oui. Tu peux, euh, si tu as quelqu'un qui peut avoir des places gratuites pour le cinéma, tu peux euh, aller euh, le voir. Comme là, moi, euh, quand euh, Sonic sortira, je verrai avec ma mère pour qu'elle me euh, passe une place grat gratuite. Comme ça, euh, je m'emmerderai pas. À payer. J'aurais juste à prendre les lunettes euh, 3D au cas où euh, c'est en 3D. changer pour demain Batman j'économise pour le festival ah ok cool Tu veux pas changer Bon ça changera plus tard hein. Ok le festival de rap C'est euh, 4... oh, 80 boules euh, bah, C'est un peu cher Bon moi c'est pas euh, Que je m'emmerde mais euh, Je vais te dire euh, Plus que 10 jours C'est le début le 21 juin, euh, c'est Ça va C'est le jour de la fête de la musique, quoi. Et moi, tu rajoutes 11 jours, et c'est mon anniv. gérer pour vous faire un bingo
Voilà. Là, c'est pour demain euh, ce que j'ai mis. Moi je vais arrêter là, euh, Sky. On se dit à demain. Bon, les gens, euh, si euh, vous voulez me suivre, euh, que ce soit sur YouTube, euh, Discord ou autre, euh, vous pouvez me demander mon Discord plus tard, ou même demain. venir sur ma chaîne youtube ou autre euh, pour me voir pour voir tout ce que je fais ou autre vous avez tout en description en bas moi je vous souhaite une bonne journée une bonne soirée tout ce que vous voulez quand vous reviendrez je vais vous mettre en ma chaîne youtube et je vous dis à bientôt au revoir les gens Ciao ciao, c'était Pilogis Laval. Ciao ciao, à demain Clive.